crazy bag lady. So it's Saturday morning. <gasps> Blue skies. It's like we've woken up abroad or something. But no, we're in England. Blue skies. So it's going to be quite nice all day, I think. I would like to get in the garden, but my husband did mention something about going to a charity shop. So not sure what we're doing today yet. So it's quarter past nine. I've just finished getting ready. So morning, me. Lovely Flora. Pat Peggy. Well, I forgot so many people we have to speak to. Bubba. Um, positive mental health potato. So if you're feeling a bit run down, look at yesterday's comment section. It is full of hearts and it just shows you're not alone and lots of us understand how you're feeling. So yeah, yesterday's comment section, it's full. It's full of hearts and flowers and it's just so lovely. So thank you to everybody that took the time to put a little heart or a flower. It just means so much to know that we all understand each other. So, calendar of the day. Uh, it's the weekend one, so you get two. So we've got, put a sweet note to yourself under your pillow Saturday night, then read it on Sunday and smile. Oh, that's quite sweet, isn't it? We should try that, that's lovely. Uh, Chanel Pocket Wisdom, we've got, may my legend gain ground, I wish it a long and happy life. Well, she certainly left a legacy behind, didn't she? Uh, a black cab wisdom. We've got, life is like a set of stairs. If you look back, you will trip up. That's so wise. Look after your body. It's the only place you've got to live. <laughs> I like the stairs one. I think we should all remember that. Don't look back. You're not going in that direction. You're going forward. So onwards and upwards, my darlings. Hmm. So I've come in the kitchen to put the kettle on and... Look at that, on the worktop. Lovely, isn't it? <laughs> Bloody husband. <laughs> it's a kitchen worktop, it's not a garage. You do not put battery packs on the worktop. And I do love him, but he does make a mess. <laughs> it's like I spend all week cleaning up and he spends all weekend uncleaning it. <laughs> He's a pain, isn't he? Look, he's messed about with me throw on my chair. Oh, dear. Right, anyway, so we need to get a cup of tea and some breakfast. <sighs> breakfast. So breakfast this morning. I've got a shredded wheat with blueberries, raspberries, chocolate squares for my hubster and bran plates for my friends. Right. And, of course, dedicated foodie. Little foodie Florence. You know, don't you? I'm only half nose but can't bother to move. Right, there you go, Florence. And Dolly is asleep on the sofa in the room. She definitely can't bother to come. Right, Winifred. Ooh, are you going to sit up? We are clever. There you go. Enjoy your bran flake. <laughs> Boring job. So we need to wash up and dishwasher. Um, and I've got some washing to put in, so I need to go and sort that out as well and get it in and possibly get it on the washing line. 10.25. So... No washing has gone in the washing machine because my husband's decided we're going charity shopping. So I thought, well, I'll do wash when I get back. He suddenly developed a bit of urge for rummaging. He started a couple of weeks ago and seems to really like it. I'm not sure if I want him going rummaging with me. I quite like it when he just used to drop me off. <laughs> anyway, so lipstick of the day. We've got on Avon Power Stay Lip Colour in Can't Quit Cafe. I've put my old glasses on. I woke up with a horrible headache and I thought, oh, I don't know if it's from them blooming glasses pulling my eyes. So I've put my old ones back on. Um, but I've got a day and it's one of those headaches you can have all day. They're so horrible. Um, and I'm sure it's to do with my blooming eyes. So I don't know whether my old glasses will make my headache worse or not. I really don't know. Anyway, so we're going for a rummage. And away we go. So, all washing and all chores abandoned for a little rummage. Look at the piggies in the field, bless them. drove past it, looks very interesting. We love a rummage. God, it's freezing. <laughs> it's so cold.
it's a worry worm. A worry worm. There's loads of them. I don't know, but they're cool. <laughs> Gosh, I've never seen knitting needles like that before. So much stuff. Wow. Look at these little tiny things, little card holders. That's nice. So, did you enjoy charity shop number one? Woo! So, we're now off to another one, 10 to 12. I'm hungry. <laughs> That just looks like Dolly, doesn't it? <laughs> that could almost be Dolly. <laughs> I love that. I might have that for having my dinner on. <laughs> Right, it's now making me walk to another one, but it's miles from where we are. Yeah, and we're gonna get run over. The world's narrowest path. <laughs> I don't like walking. Oh god, he's letting you go. I like all the old stonework down here, it's interesting. 
top. They're like buildings are made from really old stone. And it's freezing. Oh, look how sad it is. I bet once upon a time it was really nice little shop. Pound. Can't go wrong for a pound. Mm, I'm guessing that little carriage clocks. Nobody wanted them. <laughs> There's loads of them. I've wound that thing up and it won't stop making a noise. <laughs> I love looking at Teddy's, they're so cute. This is so cute. I think Dolly might like it. It's so cute. I like the chair, it's cool. Right, so we're on neighbour duties again. So she's rung us up again. This time she needs some milkshake and a paper. Let's go and get it. Hi. 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 Right, got the paper, got the milkshake. Get me home, it's two o'clock, I need me dinner. Right, finally made it home, so it's about 10 past two. So dinner, I've got one Tesco white roll with cooked chicken and cranberry. And then a bit of chicken for my friends. Ooh, right, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for your chicken? Right, wait a minute then. Right, Florence, there you go, darling. Um, Dollykins, here you go. And we just need to find Winnie. Winnie Fred, I can't believe you don't get out for a piece of chicken. Look at you, you lazy little thing. No, no. Right, quick. <laughs> to hold back the hold back the enemy. They're gonna eat it. Oh quick. <laughs> oh, I'm back to reality. Back to the washing. Right, I'll show you what I bought in a minute, but I did get a little present for Dolly. <laughs> Let's go find her. Oh Dolly. Dolly? Ooh, baby, look what we've got here. I've got you a present, look! Come on then, here you go! Oh, little baby mousey for you! Like it? Little baby mouse. Get it then. Oh, that was lovely. Be gentle with her then, don't pull her tail off or her ears. Oh, do you like it? That's beautiful. You beautiful little mouse. 
house. What have you done to her? I can't see her now. <laughs> oh, she's lovely. She's a lovely mouse, isn't she? I think you're squashing her face. <laughs> she can't breathe. Put the mouse down quick. <laughs> That's it. Lick her. Make her better. Oh, I love you, little mouse. I love you very much. Oh. Dolly and a mouse, Dolly and a mouse, doo 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 doo, Dolly and a mouse. Right, next thing I bought was this. So I bought it because I've seen on the internet people make their own artwork. So they literally get like an old canvas picture like this and then they get some filler and they like do all like shapes across it and paint it and stuff. And I know you can buy them like that, but I really wanted to have a go at making my own. So I got this because it actually comes with a wooden frame and the lady I watched on the internet, the tutorial, she bought wood and made a frame around a canvas herself, but this one actually came with a frame. And actually, it's cool, it was seven pounds. So uh, yeah, that's gonna be one of my little projects soon. And I bought the plate. Ta -da! So it is for eating your dinner off and stuff, cause it is microwave and dishwasher safe. Um, it's cool, new dinner plate. Although it might be a bit big, but if it's a bit big, I might let James have it as his dinner plate. We all have our own random dinner plates. I love it, it's so cute. Um, I got a brush set for Rebooted brand new. Look at this. It's amazing. I'm quite tempted to keep it myself. It's so lovely. Um, I got this, uh, which is, well, I think it's brand new. Um, like a little uh, wicker basket pot thing. But I was thinking you could use it outside or get like a fake plant to put in it or whatever but just liked it and it was two pounds super bargain um and then i got this which i was so excited about so it is a cucumber spiral cutter so you can use it for cucumber carrots potatoes courgettes if it works it might not work i presume that is all there so i think you just like poke it in and spin it around or something but we have cucumber quite a lot so i was very excited about this she loves a mouse that's so cute oh is it your little baby do you love it are you holding it with your little foot oh dun, 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 dun. we have a giveaway we have two little giveaways so two little prizes these are little worry worms so i've got one for ruby and i got two to give away because obviously we do talk about mental health and i thought Maybe having one of these in your pocket might help you a little tiny, tiny bit. So, worry worm. It says, keep me close, keep me near. So if a worry does appear, hold me tight, whisper it in my ear. I'll make your worry disappear. So you have nothing left to fear. So the question of the day is, all you got to do is answer the question of the day if you would like to win one. It doesn't matter where you are in the world. So question of the day is, can you guess what my husband bought from the charity shop today? Something very random. We're going to give you four things to choose from. And you need to put in the comment section and like um, A, B, C or D. So, right, are you ready for the choices? Hang on. Right, okay. So your four choices are A, a taxidermy squirrel. B, a ukulele. C, a broken Henry Hoover. And D, a wooden chess set, an old one. <laughs> Let us know down below, A, B, C or D. And we'll put all the correct answers into a hat next week and we'll pick out two winners. A, B, C or D, which do you think? Ooh, right, ladies and gentlemen, there's my tea. So for tea tonight, I've got 180 grams of McCain's chips. So small portion of frozen peas, Young's fish, and 20 grams of mozzarella, and some very low fat mayonnaise. Have to enjoy it. Oh, my tea was lovely. Can you guess what time it is? Right, Florence. No, that's not yours, darling. No. Uh, Winnie Bird. <laughs> Okay, go Winnie. And last but not least, noisy little dolly. Go! <laughs> Come on, sweetheart. Right, hang on then. Right, go! And best time of the day, a bit of sunshine. I'm trying to drive Ruby's blooming tracksuit and it weighs a ton. It's a nightmare and you can't tumble dry them because I've got all like sparkly bits on it. Oh, and our little calendar. Take time to be friendly. It is the road to happiness. Take time to love and to be loved. It is the privilege of the gods. Take time to look around. It's too short a day to be selfish. Take time to laugh. It's music of the soul. Right. 
Hi my dears, I'm going to lovely leave you. So many thanks for joining me again today. I hope you've enjoyed it. Obviously we've had a busy day charity shopping and encouraging my husband who now loves charity shopping. It's only took him about 20 years. Um, so if you do enjoy just a little bit of real life, then please subscribe to my channel. Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. My dogs have got Instagram, which is Free Fluffles. My website is down below and my little Avon shop's down below. And don't forget to enter our little giveaway. So I love you and leave you. I'll see you tomorrow.